I'm Rob Cardwell, and here are some of the day's top stories. A grand jury has indicted a Spotsylvania County Sheriff's deputy for shooting 32-year-old Isaiah Brown in April of this year. According to lawyers representing Brown, Deputy David Turbyfill is charged with reckless handling of a firearm, resulting in serious injury, which is a Class 6 felony. Brown's lawyers are calling for the immediate termination of Deputy Turbyfill, who remains on administrative leave. Starting this weekend, Los Angeles County health officials will again require masks be worn indoors, even by those vaccinated against COVID-19. This comes as just about all states across the U.S. see rising infection rates in recent weeks. The Surgeon General is calling COVID-19 misinformation an urgent threat to public health and says social media companies need to do more to address it. And now here's Tom. All right, thanks a lot, Rob. Another hot, humid day in this pattern of heat and humidity that we've had all week. Today, we'll look for a high of around 95 degrees. The average is 90. And we'll have the heat index about those same hours near 100 degrees today. So if you're working outside, be careful. Uh, any storm chances, I think, are rather isolated today. We'll leave just a small chance in. The better chances are tomorrow. More humidity tonight, still warm, 75 degrees for the overnight low temperature. And uh, right now, just a partly cloudy to mostly clear sky. We have a few scattered clouds. And this is the system that will be affecting us by Saturday afternoon and evening. It will bring scattered showers and thunderstorms. It's a cold front. It will also bring some cooler temperatures. Well, not, you know, not spring-like, but the 80s will return at least. So today, 95. Tomorrow, 93. Although tomorrow will have a big spike in humidity, so it's going to be a very humid afternoon before these storms hit. And then we could still see a few storms Sunday and Monday afternoon. Slight chance by next Tuesday with some nice 80 degree readings by then 70s and 60s at night. And that is your forecast from CBS 6, the Weather Authority. Have a great weekend.